Welcome to WHIT Radio Heads. Today, I'm. We have two guest stars, Miguel and Javier. What's up, guys? And we did. We're gonna start talking about relationships again. So, I want. Oh, and today we also have Liz over there. Love you, miss you. Um, <laughs> Caroline and Jessica. Yay. Okay. <laughs> so, what do you guys hate about girls the most? Bored. <laughs> okay, seriously, what do you Um, mean? I don't know. Girls with attitudes. Like if they just if they're just mean, I just I can't get along with them. That's okay, horrible. cool. Girls that talk too much. Oh Why? Oh. What's so bad about talking? They just it, wanna know like they just wanna express their feelings. I mean the problem isn't talking. Like I, I could talk with a girl, but it's so much. Like you just don't shut up. It's just <laughs> what's this? What are we gonna do now? Because how old are you? How old's your cat? How old's your mom? I mean, it can't Can all be about mom? the girl. It has Can to be yeah. guys to talk. But Can I make cookies but with you? Girls don't. don't know, like. uh, girls don't ask so much about their self. They ask about you because they want to get to know you. You know, like they just want to get to know who they're gonna go out with, who they have potential relationships with. You know? Yes. No. Girls talk too much. So. All right. <laughs> so, how would you say? Are you guys good at on hitting at on girls? Do you guys hit, flirt a lot? We can't judge ourselves. Like. Yeah, the girl <laughs> has to judge us. Have you seen Javier flirting with someone? Uh, that's another personal question. I don't answer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, have you seen Miguel flirting with anyone? I'll be honest. I've seen Miguel flirting with girls, and he, he is a chick magnet. I mean, he gets the girls to talk Thanks, to him. Thanks, Javier. No problem, man. He, he goes in, and he's, he's smooth with his words. All right, that's cool. So how would you give anyone tips on how to hit on a girl? What would you say, like, be yourself or try to act tough? Don't be yourself. I think that's, that's so true, tip. honestly. Like, I think when a guy's too much of himself, the girl's going to take him for granted. Because I think some guys are really sweet, but they shouldn't show that to a girl. They should show their manly side and then come in with the You really can't be yourself because girls kind of judge too much. Well, everybody judges a lot, so you, you can't just be yourself. You kind of have to, like, act different. And once a girl gets to know you, you could try to be yourself, and then she's already used to you. All right, but do you guys have any questions for girls? Anything you guys want to know? Why do you want to know everything? <laughs> like, it's an honest question. I think it's because, like, girls... It's so hard to, like, know what guys are like. Like, every guy's different, but we just want to know, like, why are some guys so, like, annoying sometimes and why are they, you know, there's some things that we just want to know. We ha how are we annoying? Because you see how you're just doing this right now? You're saying everything I'm saying back to me. Like, that's right. annoying. I mean, but, like, it's scientific fact that... Our brains develop slower, so. Okay, so Liz. All right. What What do you guys? What do you want to know about guys? Um. Why do they cheat on girls? Sure. Why do you guys cheat on girls? Just cause. <laughs> okay. Stuff happens. Because <laughs> maybe you guys get bored of the same girl and what she has to offer. I think I sometimes, honestly, it's okay, some girls. Some girls. We got, we got a phone call. Oh, we do. <laughs> Hello. 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 Oh. Hello. Hi, Skippy. Hello. What's up? Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. So. Andrew, what are you, you doing have now? To lower the radio. So, Skippy, have you had a girlfriend before? Uh, no. Do you want to have your first girlfriend anytime soon? In the future. And what do you want her to be like? Yeah, a very beautiful girl. <laughs> a very beautiful girl. Do you want her to be like any blonde, brunette, She redhead? needs to be a Knicks fan. She needs to be a Knicks fan. All right, Skip? <laughs> and it's maybe blonde or brunette. Oh, I see. All right, you're good. She How about eyes? How do you want her eyes to be? Either blue or brown. Oh, okay, cool. Atta boy. All right. So yeah, Skippy. Bye. No. All right. Bye. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh. So rude. Oh no. I'm sorry. <clears throat> All right. So how would would you ever say any of your friends have taken your girlfriends or flirted with your girlfriends? No. Not really. No. <clears throat> I think personally, some some girls have. Like I think I don't know, guys. This is. 
Are you okay? Does somebody want to pick it up? Um, why do you guys feel the need to, like, play with, like, two girls at once? Like, why can't you just say face full of one girl? I'm not saying all guys are the same, but, like, those specific guys. And I know you guys know one guy that... I mean, no, you worded it kind of weird because guys don't feel the need to do it. It's just, like... It happens. Like, I mean, and part of it is the girl's fault. Like, I'm putting it out there. Because if you're going to give a guy all the attention, he's not going to, like, reject all these girls. Like, it's too much estrogen going at him so, so he's not gonna be like no estrogen like he's gonna be like would bring you it say over that here. a girl could do so a guy could like her more <clears throat> i think that's a personal question don't you think it's better if a girl like ignores a guy who like gets a lot of attention would you say that would catch his attention no no so giving him more attention would because i mean like the thing is all right look like girls overthink all of that like should i give him more attention should i give him less attention it's just like be cool with him and then he i mean guys like dig girls that are just chill how but, about but i don't think a girl wants to be confused as a friend though you know like have you ever seen that show friend, friend zone? zone yeah yeah, I have. Okay, so, like, I don't think anyone, like, that, like, I just think this is the wrong thing with guys. Guys, sometimes, they, they're too friendly, and then girls just think of them as friends, you know? And then they don't get it. But that's, 99% of the time, it's the other way around. What do you it's mean? the guy's too nice, then the girl takes him as a friend, and he's, like, trying to be himself around her, and he really likes her, and then the girl's, like, you know, she, she's into some other guy. I mean, I think, honestly, like, I think some girls just feel the need to have a guy who, like, isn't so nice. Like, I think it's good to have, like, a mixture of both. Like, not too, too nice, but not mean. Just right, you know? Like, if you're always, like, on top of me, I am going to know you're always going to be there for me, so I'm not, I'm going to want my space. So what do you want, like, from a guy? Like, what is it exactly? I think, well, personally, I think all girls want a guy who's, like, big. Besides physics, like, okay, any, yeah. so inside. And not all girls, like you, like your okay, personal Okay, like preference. me, I think I, physically, or... Cause no, there's like, a, personality. Just overall, yeah. personality. Personality, I just want a guy who's really nice. Because there's so many, like, I can't curse, but no. there's so many mean <laughs> people out there, and I don't want a guy who's just mean. Because in the end, that's how he's going to treat me. I think, actually, when I think of it, I don't want a guy who... And I've said this before. <laughs> I don't want a guy who drinks, smokes, or. Um, well, does I don't drugs. think at 15 you're going to find a. No, guy that yes, you are. <laughs> you're not going to find be, an alcoholic. You'd be, at 15 yes, years old. you'd be so surprised. There are so many people who drink. Like, outside of these walls, there is a lot of people. Like, that's another thing. Like, people drink, they smoke, they do a lot of things. They want to, like, run out. Let's, like, keep, let's keep it PG here. Let's relax. No, no, it's okay. We can talk about this, right, Mr. Uh, if you know people who do, I guess. Is, okay, you know, so you see, like, there is people our age that do smoke. Okay, I have a drink. question to you guys. <laughs> All right, it's a question. <laughs> 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 All right, so if you have, like, a girlfriend, right, does she? Does it make her more attractive if, the guy, if your friend's around, you think she's attractive too? Like, think she's really hot, or does it not matter? Kind of like if if everybody thinks she's really ugly, it's kind of gonna you, you're not gonna like or her. Or if much. they think she's really attractive. So well, if, if everyone she, if thinks your friends think she's really attractive and they all like, you know, want to meet her and stuff, like does that make you more attracted to her? Most guys don't do that though. Like I mean, if like let's say like Miguel brought a really hot chick and that was his girlfriend, and then that she brought it to the crew of guys. Like, we wouldn't be like, dude, can we get to know her? Yeah. Like, no, it'd be like, more like, like a, yeah, man, you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think it's like, what she means is like, what if they're your friends? Like, if you're all friends, and then there's this one girl who, like, make pretend Jessica's friend, like, she's really pretty, and you all see her, and you guys think she's pretty. Like, doesn't that make her more attractive that everyone around you wants yeah. her? Oh, that definitely, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Like, yeah. everyone, I think that's so true. Like, for guys, like, if everyone wants that one guy and you, like, know him, like, inside, like, that he's so sweet and all that, like, I think that makes you more attracted to him and you want him. But then again, I think girl-wise, like, we wouldn't pay attention, well, I wouldn't pay attention to him because, like, if they're weird, like, if they're cocky, that, that just ruins God. Don't be cocky, guys. That's really bad. It's Same awesome. goes to you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. Okay, so signs when a guy is cheating on you. What would you say is like something a guy does that is shows that he's cheating on you? He's we not can, as affectionate. We can't this. Yeah, we can. We, 
we can't answer. All right, I'll answer. Yeah. I think that when a guy's cheating on you, um, he's, like, less affectionate to the girl. Mm-hmm. What would you guys say is something that a girl does that shows you that she's cheating on you? I don't know. Like, we're 15. Like, <laughs> we're not okay, married. Okay, well, I think, I think when a guy's cheating on you, my friend's boyfriend was cheating on her, and I was with her while he was cheating on her, like, the day of that he was cheating on her, and there was things that he did that showed that he was cheating on her. First of all, he was on his phone while they were together. He hid the phone from her all the time. Like, why can't you text in front of me? Oh, yeah. I mean, if it gets to something like that, like, something that's obvious, I mean, then you shouldn't even, like, second guess it. But yeah. Like, like, I so he would be texting, and then he, like, he, my mom, my friend's mom was going to give him a ride, and then she's like, oh, here, I'll take you, because he lived really far away. And he's like, no, no, I'll take the bus, I'll take the bus. And he was texting someone. So my theory is that he was, like, with another girl, and he was leaving to the girl's house after that. Maybe he just wants to be by himself on the bus. No. No, but in the end, hold up. In the end, he was cheating on her. He was. Like, he. the next day, like, someone told my friend that they were kissing, and it was true. Jesus. Who was this friend? Was it a girl? Yeah. yeah. Obviously. It's not going to so, be. I don't think guys really get <laughs> cheated on. That's that's not true at all. That is, oh, my God, no. I, well, don't I, even, at least don't I don't, even. okay, because, look, I think girls cry about it and stuff like that, and it shows, but guys don't cry about it. They're like, oh. On to the next one. Are you kidding? No, 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 no. That's that's, that's how we act, idea. but it, it hurts inside. Like yeah, but you don't show others that it hurts. Like, have you ever been cheated on? Not that I know of. <laughs> <laughs> but does it? Oh, okay. But have you ever found no, no. at all ever? I mean, cause like if you all right, let's say Miguel gets cheated on. If he really likes the girl, I mean, he's not gonna go around crying about it and writing Facebook like. Yeah, yeah. Status is like, oh like, my god, her. crying so hard right now. Yeah, because you guys love the, doing that. Yeah. You know, anything happens. Oh my god, he's such a <laughs> jerk. Okay. Yeah, he's such I a jerk. Let's let's kill his reputation right now. <laughs> I honestly, I think girls do do that a lot. But I think inside you're just in pain. How about you, Liz? Have you ever had a guy cheat on you? Yeah. And how was that like? I mean, it didn't bother me because. It was pretty obvious, so I kind of like knew it was gonna happen. So you, but what you did? You break up with him immediately, or did you like scream at him and like punch him or whatever? We talked about it and then we broke up. I'm not I gonna hit talked. him. I would have just got to the point and yelled. If I don't you know. guys found out a girl was ever cheating on you, what would you do? Would you talk? How would you break up with her? I, I just, I just break up with yeah, her. Get the boys. You. Break up with her? Just yeah. it's it's down. just on to the next one because really yeah. Well, how would you say it though? Like, I, would I you just be like, "It's over. You cheated on me," or would you like sit down and talk to her? Like, why would you do that? No, would you I probably curse her out. But and wouldn't say, All right, but bye. wouldn't you want to find out why she cheated on you? No, I'd just be like, "You're wasting my time." Right. That's it. Okay. Cool. So. I guess they know why she wasn't happy in the relationship. Oh well. Yeah, but, you know, like, sometimes there is a reason for cheating. Like, it, it maybe it's not a good reason, but some girls cheat on guys for, like, a reason, you know? And that's the problem, because, like, the girls just overthink everything, and then they, like, make these conclusions out of nothing. Like, oh, my God, I he did I think it this, all starts like this. When a girl starts talking to another guy, and, like, sometimes people think you might be flirting, but you're just being friendly and just being nice. And then the boyfriend's like, she's flirting, I'm going to flirt. And then... The, they're both trying to get away from each other yet show people that they are together and then they see like each other like on like flirting with different people and they do it on each other's faces too like I've seen that happen yeah and okay so have you guys ever been in a fight because of a girl nope not in a fight but like once things got like weird with me and my friend because we both like the same girl and like things got awkward real quick but it was like one of those things where we're like dude like it's we're, just a we're, girl. we're the boys and she's a girl, so yeah. screw her. Okay, so so that's it for today. Thank you for watching. These are the freshman radio heads. See you next time. Bye. Bye guys. Oh god.